हेलो एवरी वन आई एम पूनम जाधव वर्किंग एज असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ कंप्यूटर इंजीनियरिंग ए आई एस एस एम एस आई ओ आई टी पुणे टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी द टॉपिक रूल ऑफ सम एंड रूल ऑफ प्रोडक्ट विच कम्स अंडर काउंटिंग प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ डिस्क्रीट मैथमेटिक्स कोर्स नाउ रूल ऑफ सम If an event can occur in m ways and another event can occur in n ways and if these two events cannot occur simultaneously then one of the two event can occur in m plus n ways if there are n choices for one action and m choices for another action and the two actions cannot be done at the same time then there are n plus m ways to choose one of these actions the rule of sum only applies to choice that are mutually exclusive meaning that only one of the choice can be picked if the question can be rephrased with the word or it indicates that the rule of sum applies For example if there are 10 boys and 8 girls in a class find the number of ways of selecting one student as a class represented so by using the rule of sum there are 10 plus 8 that is 18 ways of selecting one student either a boy or a girl as a class representative consider the another example if a student is getting admission in four different engineering colleges and two medical colleges find the number of ways of choosing one of the above colleges so by using the rule of sum there are 4 plus 2 that is six ways of choosing one of the college consider third example if there are 20 boys and 15 girls in a class then find the number of ways of selecting one student as a class representative a boy can be selected in 20 ways a girl can be selected in 15 ways so by using the rule of sum there are 20 plus 15 that is 35 ways of selecting one student as a class representative now the rule of product if an event can occur in m ways and a second event can occur in n ways and if number of ways the second event occur does not depend upon the occurrence of the first event then the two events can occur simultaneously in m into n ways the rule of product states that if there are n ways of doing something and m ways of doing another thing after that then there are m into n ways to perform both of these actions in other words when choosing an option for n and an option for m there are m into n different ways to do both actions consider the example three persons enter into car where there are five seats in how many ways can they take up the seats the first person has a choice of five seats and can sit in any one of those seats so there are five ways to occupy the first seat the second person has a choice of four seats the third person has a choice of three seats hence the required number of ways in which all the three person can sit is 5 into 4 into 3 that is 16 ways
Let us consider another example for rule of product. A coin is tossed three times and the outcomes are recorded. How many possible outcomes are there? Every time the coin is tossed, we can get either a head or tail. Since the coin is tossed three times, the number of possible outcomes is 2 into 2 into 2. That is 8. So, 8 possible outcomes are there. Consider one more example. How many words of three distinct letters can be formed from the letters of the word must? So, letters are distinct and here the required number of words is 4 into 3 into 2. That is 24. Thank you.